Hey everyone, and at this time, let's take a look at it, deleting all of your photos inside your Photos app on the iPhone. And there are, again, multiple different approaches, because if you go to your settings and go to the storage section right away, you can get there by going to the uh, general, and there is the iPhone storage. You can see how much of the photos actually take up of the, st uh, the storage on your iPhone. So even right here, once everything fully loads up, you can actually sort of manage it uh, right here so you can review personal videos, those that are really large, so you can delete them here as well in case you want to like uh, play with the storage. However, if you want to delete all of your photos on your iPhone, it is very simple because I want you to go to your photos app and at the lower tab bar, you have four buttons. You have library for you, albums and search. So tap on albums and it's going to get you to this section and go to the main one to the recents. And there is also the select button. So if you click on a select, you can just drag it around and select as many photos as you want. However, if you want to select all of them and in case you have like 12,000 photos or 11,000 as I have, then it's going to be much more difficult and much more complicated to like select all of them. So in this case, tap on select and just select the one or two rows of icons. And instead of lifting your finger, you're just going to keep it at there and use the other finger to scroll on your iPhone. So scroll through the photos while the other finger is on the screen. And as you can see, it is just selecting all of the photos that it sees. So that's really simple. And if you have so many photos, you can also use the tab to scroll up gesture. So you can also just tap on the corner in the at the upper left side of the display. And if you tap it, it's just going to drag it all the way to the top. And it's just going to basically select every single photo on your iPhone. This is how it works. Of course, this method is done best when you have like thousands of photos. So uh, that's how you can select all of them. However, I still believe that it's much better to like manually go through each of the photos so you know best which one is actually the one that you want to keep and which one is the one you want to delete. So that's uh, my recommendation on how I do it. So that would be about it. Hope the video helped you out. Also, one thing is that once you select them, then you naturally, of course, have to click on the trash can to delete them. That's like kind of obvious, but I just had to mention it. And also, if you delete them, this doesn't mean that they disappear from your iPhone because they're still going to be part of the recently deleted section. So in the albums, if you scroll all the way to the bottom, there is the recently deleted with the trash can sort of section. So go ahead and open it up. And there you need to like re uh, like delete all the photos again. So if you leave it there for 30 days, it's just going to stay there. But if you just delete them right away, they're going to disappear forever from your iPhone. So again, that would be about it. Hope the video helped you out. I'm going to catch you in the future ones. But if you like this one, make sure to leave a thumbs up and also subscribe for more videos. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll catch you in the future. Peace.